Uh, hello YouTube, this is Michael again. Uh, I'm doing the video today because um, someone who subscribes to my channel uh, did a video using you know my channel and he was pointing out how many things he was seeing. He was kind of blown away. But he was talking about um, the image of a, an apparition in the clouds that's in the, the particular video. His video is called Insane Cloud Screenshots, MacArthur Seek and Seek speak truth and the channel is the war above us but he was telling you know or just mentioning you know that this that there was an image of a stag and a stag um represents and i guess in the spiritual or um whatever uh nimrod um and nimrod was the king who um organized the building of the Tower of Babel and who wanted to usurp his authority and defeat uh, God to build the tower so God changed the languages of the people and this is in the Old Testament but uh, Nimrod was also known before he died as a great hunter so the person was kind of um, you know war warning me I guess you know that this apparition it's not this one it's a di it's in a, d a different movie but uh, um you know it is apparition of um a stag and i have been seeing this apparition of the stag for over a year now recently like more often much more often um and so i just wanted to point it out to you and also help um maybe teach everyone how to use their discernment and their um, spiritual eyes to see these things when they manifest in the clouds. They're not clouds, they're chemtrail remnant clouds and they are demonically inspired. And something is going on in the second heaven right now that is different than we've experienced and it's part of the fallen angels and uh, Lucifer's plan for God's children. God has his own plan as well, but um, it's good to be spiritually and um, have a relationship with the Heavenly Father, Yahuwah, and his true son, Yeshua, um, in these times. Anyway, so let's do this. Um, here we go. Here's the horn right here. One horn. Um, here's the eye. And I filmed this film about a week ago. Um, I wasn't even in... Cathedral City or Palm Springs. I was in, near Anaheim. Um, here's the nose, two nostrils, the straight across mouth, the chin, the other eye socket, the top of the head. So that's a stag, or like, you know, like a male deer. This is the same day, same parking lot. <laughs> the stag was like just on the other side. But here we have a demonic entity face right here, two eye sockets and the teeth. And then if you look this way, because they usually come in threes, the spiritual entities appear in threes a lot of times. Probably most of the time. I just don't see the, them all, all the time. But here's two eye sockets, the nose, and a laughing gestural mouth. Um, you can see the teeth, individual teeth. And the proportions. And of course, you know, the wild windswept hair here's just another um picture of that stag same day there's been a lot of um here's the all-seeing eye again here's the sun here's the uh, the pupil right there in the middle and then the round circular maybe like a light colored eye and then the eye socket and the cornea the cornea is the white part of the eye all seen eye by the sun. This was the same day last week sometime. Here's two profiles of two demonic looking entities with horns. Here's the eye, uh, the forehead, eyebrow ridge, eye socket, nose, chin. It's a square jaw, so it's a male. Another male. More horns. There you go. This is like a tutorial to help you show you in case you don't see. Just follow the red lines. Look for the eyes. What is this? <laughs> oh, that's just that's just him again. But the other eye came in clearer now. See? 
There's the eye, the eye, the nose, the, the flat lips, like a male uh, stag lips, and of course the horn again. Here's, this is from like a year ago. Again, you can see the eye. You get my pointer. It's the eye right here. Round circular eye. Another eye, fur. You know, it just looks like a beast. I'm not so sure it's a stag. Here's, uh, let me do it this way. Use your, uh, I don't want to say imagination because these things are real, but if you use your eyes, do you see the eyes now? The eyelashes, the eyebrow ridges, he's looking down, okay? And then we got, we'll go here, and then see the eyeglasses and the lips and the nose, the hair. Okay, here's the original image. You can see her no, uh, nostrils, her lips, pouty lips, uh, double chin, so it's female. Here's, I like sunglasses, hair, etc. That was, these are pictures of clouds, people. The chemtrail remnant clouds. This one's a little creepier. Let's go one more this way. Here's another stag. This was like from about eight months ago. Here's a very clear eye, another eye socket, nose, lips. This represents the teeth. Here's the horn at the top and an ear. So let's go back this way. This is more of a close up. I wanted to show you how clear the eye was. Retract it back. He has some mangled looking teeth. And there's the one that I outlined. You can see the horn on the top again and the mangled teeth. Sorry, I don't have any um, exp expensive technology or knowledge how to use these computers better for you. Let's see how, how far we can get here. We're in seven minutes. So I do want to show you some of the newer stuff. This is a flat earth. Um, this is important too, but I'll do another video on that. The guy was mentioning ships, like a, a new movie that has new types of aircraft that are in the clouds. So I have a lot of images of that stuff, leaving shadows in the clouds that should not be like unnatural shadows coming from what, who knows. Um, I want to get to that's there's so many different faces in this one that I would take too long to describe um, <clears throat> this is another stag that came down I was I was um, you know doing my video and this formed and it made a light and it glowed but if you look at it closely it's a stag or it has the ears like a stag here on the side here's the eye sockets I, I don't see horns necessarily but um, this is one of the films that I have. It has 13,000 views. This formed in the clouds while I was speaking. Here's the horns again. The forehead, the eyebrow ridges, the nose, the mouth, the chin, and the other horns there. You can watch the video. It's called Demon... Uh, something like Demon Apparition in the Clouds. This is really creepy. Look at the alien eyes there, whatever those are. But there's two sets. There's eyes here, and you can see this one very clearly. So that one's like a rat, but when you pull it all the way back, it's like this ugly alien thing with a big mouth. That's a creepy one. If you ask me, it's creepy. Um, let's see. Ooh, just look how creepy that was. I just saw that today, and I was like, oh, no. <laughs> okay. Here's more horned creatures. We're at nine minutes, so I'm going to stop very soon. You can see these horns go like across her face. And I've shown this one before. Um, oh, I really want to get to those other images. I might have to do two videos. Because some of this is pretty important. Look at the horns on the top of her head. And the horns on the side and her piercing eyes. Her, I, I believe, well it's probably, it's probably him, but. Um. Yeah, and then, you know, her mouth opens up. I don't know why I say her, but, you know, she, during the video, like, the it's opening its mouth. You can see the teeth clearly. 
the her dental ridge, the upper dental ridge with the teeth. Anyway, um, this is the ones that were freaking me out. <laughs> Not none of them freak me out because I I understand good versus evil. But I do, and I can tell when evil's in our skies. Um, these ones, I'll do another video. This was recently, but I mean, there was just some the craziness going on in the sky, um, and it's not natural. It has nothing to do with weather. Um, okay, so I'm gonna end it here because it's 10:39. Um, I just want to remind everyone to treat each other the way you want to be treated. Um, respect yourself, respect others, look for righteousness, and seek a relationship with the Heavenly Father and the True Son, Yeshua HaMashiach. Hallelujah. Amen. Thank you, and thank you for watching.